great to have you working around the boat with us again. I'm John Graviscus, and welcome to America's favorite boat improvement show, Ship Shape TV. This panel came off of our 20-foot Bertram Moppy. The technical name for the piece is called the transom sealing. And what it does is it seals off the transom and part of the engine away from the rest of the boat. Now, do you see this molded in lip right here? Well, this is for the engine compartment hatch to fit into place. Now, originally, the panel was pretty thin and flimsy. It was only for cosmetic appeal. And over the years, we had some spider cracking going on up in this area. We also had some over here. Actually, it tore in a couple of spots as well, so I needed to stiffen up the panel by adding some material to the structure. And as you can see, it's now rock solid. Well, the next thing I want to do is I want to insulate this piece to help reduce some engine noise. And we're going to show you how to not only insulate the transom ceiling, but also the engine compartment hatch as well. And it gets a little tricky when you're talking about installing this type of material upside down and around some of those complex curves. But we've got some great tips that are going to make this job super easy. And then what we're going to do is we're going to switch gears a little bit by getting into some of the deck hardware for the boat with Steve Moyer direct from Perco. Now we're going to show you not only how to select the right size cleat and chalks, for the boat, but also how to properly mount a replacement piece of hardware when the holes on your boat don't line up with the holes that are on that replacement piece. You're invited to work right alongside us today as we show you some more great ways to make your boat shipshape.